What it do, what it do, collective. I am back with another video. So y'all voted for Aries, Capricorn, and Aquarius, okay? So I'm going to go ahead and do that reading. But first and foremost, if you're new to my channel, what it do, what it do, for my day ones, what's up, family? Go ahead and click the bell button so you'll be notified every time I post content, okay? If you're new here, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share to my YouTube channel. I am available for personal readings. All that good stuff information is in my description below. Aries, we about to get started on y'all um, general reading. And it can resonate with Aries placements, which are Sun, Moon, Rising, North Node, Venus. Okay. Um, what else was I going to say? Uh, okay, yeah, let's do, let's do, let's go out with a big bang with a prayer, okay? God, thank you for waking me up, pushing me or allowing me to be able to start my day. Um, I ask you to continue to watch over and cover me at this time right now. Um, I ask you to continue to prevent, protect me from things that serve, that does not serve my highest good, seen and unseen, heard and unheard. I ask you to block every negative energy, every negative entity that is trying to attach itself to me, my platform, and my collective. Any negative energy being sent towards my way or my collective may it return to sender, may it drop instantly, okay? Um, my spirit guides and ancestors from the highest whites is like the great divine. Protect me and help me as I'm giving Aries placement, sun, moon, north node, Venus rising, I know I heard a soft note. Protect me isn't tapping into an energy to give them a reading. We got this trickster energy that I'm picking up on. A shay shay some other beat. So I'm picking up on like this trickster energy. Somebody definitely is like watching you. And it's like somebody is like mirroring your movements, Aries. And I feel like this is somebody who like don't want to get caught. They could be in a whole different relationship. This is somebody who watches like your platform. I do feel like this person could be discussing you in a group chat. It's like it's kind of like you're under heavy surveillance or Aries, this is you with somebody else. So, um, I think we're going to do a freestyle. Like, I don't want to do hidden messages for this one. Okay, so I spy with my third eye. It's Aries, sun, moon. So, we got the justice card, okay? Page of cups, energy. Somebody wants to, like, hash things out. Okay, with the judgment card energy. And I feel like it's like now somebody wants to come forward and apologize, mend things after they um, reach some type of karma. Okay, this could be concerning like a child or somebody could have been like very, very childish. Aries, you could have been dealing with a water sign. Okay, four wands. Yeah, I feel like somebody karmic ass family is involved too as well. Um Somebody is like somebody want to be the peacemaker to a connection. Yeah, Nine of Pentacles energy. And it's like whatever this is, this could be with like a Virgo. We got Libra, Virgo, Pisces, okay. Ten of Swords, Nine of Pentacles. So I feel like um somebody definitely did something shady. Or somebody was hiding the fact that they have a whole family or like they're dealing with a karmic and i see that somebody wants to come forward and bring like some type of offer like a, a truance okay to somebody they have a family with uh five of wands it's a lot of chaotic energy i feel like somebody biggest fear is like somebody being in a, in a um connection in another connection ten of swords somebody definitely was like lying to somebody Six of Wands. It's like behind the scenes, somebody was like stirring up a lot of trouble, a lot of conflict, okay? And it's like somebody was like willing to win at all costs, yeah. This could be like a group of people. I feel like somebody was doing like spell work, moon magic, or lying, or being deceptive like on a family dynamic. Nine of Cups energy, yeah. Five of Swords. It's like whoever this is, Aries, you could be dealing with a Virgo. Somebody even could have, like, ghosted a, a family, like, disappeared and started entertaining, like, a whole different relationship. Whatever it is, it's like somebody was, like, trying to kick somebody off their high horse, okay? Somebody could be very egotistical, okay? So, we got Queen of Swords energy. I feel like it could be a woman that knows all about this, okay? It could be definitely dealing with a Libra. 
Six of Cups energy, and we got the Lover's card. So there could be a Gemini that wants to... If you're dealing with the Libra Aries, there's a Gemini that wants to reconcile with this Libra. It's kind of like somebody is crying over, like, spilled, spilled milk. It's like... You and Libra could be, like, in a connection. It's like, it's like your group of friends know about the connection or Libra group of friends know about the connection, Aries. But it's kind of like, it's really nobody's business. I feel like um, there could be, like, a Virgo that wants to come forward and, like, apologize. Judgment card, Nine of Pentacles, Ten of Swords, Six of Wands, Five of Swords. I feel like, Aries, you could be, like, people in the scenes about, like, an environment of people you around. Like, you could know that somebody is, like, shady towards somebody or, like, somebody's planning some type of betrayal. Two of Wands energy. Here's your, your energy. High Priestess. What I just said. Yeah, Two of Wands. High priest, this is like you can know all about this and like you're keeping quiet. We got the seven of cups and the three, seven of cups in reverse and the three of cups. It's like if you wonder if somebody had you figure out, they do, Aries. Yeah, um, with this hangman in reverse, like somebody is very enlightened to what's going on. And I feel like nine of wands, it can kind of throw a group of people off the fact that, like, they can't confuse or they can't up one on some, somebody. Okay, this could be somebody very, very intuitive. Yeah, seven of wands. And we got the ace of cups in reverse with the king of swords energy. There could be an air sign masculine or this could be a woman or her masculine energy. This could be somebody that, like, shows fake love. Queen of Pentacles energy. So I definitely feel like there's two masculine energies dealing with the earth sign woman. This woman could already be in a connection already. Yeah, with the Wheel of Fortune. It's like um somebody could be getting ready to go. This could be a with a Taurus. Or somebody is about to get a job offer that's about to balance out a lot in their finance department. For some of y'all, it's like somebody needs to. It's like somebody can have a some be aware of like spending your money fast. Whoever this resonates for, because it's like somebody spends money just as fast as like they earn it. Somebody definitely spends a lot of time watching somebody like trying to collect information. And this could be a Capricorn or just somebody very, very toxic. It's like somebody's obsessed with like spying, keeping tabs on somebody, trying to get answers. And I definitely feel like this is somebody that like views somebody as a threat, as like some type of competition. Okay, or like jealous, like somebody want to cause harm to to somebody, like in t like yeah, and I feel like mm, it's a lot going on, and I feel like this is different situations, but I feel like um, Aries, the energy that I'm getting is like you could just I don't really see your energy out here. It's like you could be just like watching this all take place, like low key watching this, or like you know. Okay, so where we at? We at 8. I'm going to stop at 15. So, yeah, there's a Gemini that wants to come in fast or is, like, somebody's about to have options in love. We got the star card. Somebody could be dealing with an Aquarius. There could be, like, a Sagittarius healing, okay? Yeah, there could be you healing Aries, okay? Yeah, it's like somebody wants to take a leap of faith to come give some type of offer, Okay? Five of Cups energy. Somebody could be mourning over a loss of a child. So if you have, I'm sorry to hear that. Um, yeah, Tower card. So there's going to be a Tower moment. Like a, a big drastic change in your life areas. Yeah. And we got two major iconics because the World card came in after. So it's like something is definitely closing out and it's closing out rapidly. And I feel like somebody could be stressing out. Or it could be like a time frame of when you need to have something done. I don't know why I heard, like, better have my money, okay? So, somebody could owe somebody some type of money. Mm. 
So page of swords energy. So you could have like an air sign watching you or this is like a bitter ex or a bitter baby mama. Don't have to be an air sign. She be watching you, okay? I feel like this is somebody that watch you every little step you make, okay? Five of Wands energy. It's like somebody wants some type of smoke. Somebody wants some type of static. You could feel like this woman looks for issues. She looks for drama. She wants to argue. Five of Pentacles energy. Okay, she may be going through some type of financial crisis or it's like... um yeah nine of swords six of swords whoever this is i feel like they feel left out in the cold and they feel some type of way and i feel like they want to cause a turbulence in your life somebody's trying to see like you get your ish together okay yeah eight of cups it's like somebody could be jealous or like they feel like they're somebody that's like okay Okay, another thing I'm getting, this can be somebody that be fake pumping and, like, they really got it on social media and they don't. Or, like, this is somebody that come off to the public, like, they're a macho woman, macho man, when I feel like this person really gives, like, coward energy. Like, um, they need things to be able to boost their ego. There's somebody watching, and it's kind of like somebody wants to leave a connection, a whole different connection for you death car four swords and the sun car so that's definitely giving um somebody could be stressing out over a over a death of a lost one i'm sorry to hear that and i feel like somebody could be like pretty much fighting demons in the head about this shit about like a family member that has crossed over so we got the queen of wands energy I'm seeing if you know somebody who's like a psychic medium, this could be a fire sign, Aries, is like, um, I play with the death card and four swords. Somebody really, um, is just over it. Like a situation has definitely ended. I feel like this person is more so focused on like this new beginning uh they're focused on their finances okay this could be somebody that is dealing with a virgo i feel like somebody yeah star card energy is like this person is like i'm gonna make you a celebrity overnight this person could be getting a lot of people want to take action towards them yeah seven of cups energy like they got options give me more in the seven of pentacles yeah nine of wands energy five of cups so be careful aries of like um earth sign masculine energy trying to pull wool over your eyes like hide what his intentions are and stuff i am seeing a water sign is feeling um at loss of a connection like he's feeling out of touch out of reach i feel like this could be somebody that's that's suffering in their emotions i'm hearing trauma bonded so be aware of trauma bonded with people yeah, with the full card, the seven of swords, it's like somebody is trying to make a impulsive decision. They're trying to come in hot and fast, okay? Ten of wands in the hangman energy. It's like before you get wrapped up in some stuff, figure out what's going on in these people's life. It's kind of like somebody could be going through a hard time right now and it's not necessarily like something like all oh, the end all be all this is something i feel like you definitely could fix it's just like it's it's it's, it's a mind thing it's more so like are you going to transmute that energy are you gonna you know think of a solution instead of having a pity party or oh i'm stuck in this situation how do i get myself out and somebody is clearly giving you solutions on how to get out of something so we got like what two more minutes okay so i spot one my third I, magician card came out crossing nine of swords okay so i definitely feel like somebody was either lying or, or being very manipulative or they thought they got away with something when in fact they have not and it's kind of like now somebody want to fake pump and like figure out like oh how do we yeah with the moon card this could definitely be with the pisces okay when i get moon i get really deceptive energy yeah hair fine um king of cups so this is a water sign it's kind of like a water sign was doing something very deceptive or like lying about it and um when i get the five of swords in reverse it's like somebody definitely do not get no fucks like they did it intentionally okay uh knight of cups energy 
I feel like this person, yeah. It's like somebody, this water sign stressing out. Or this, it's like they're dealing with the tourists that are stressing out in their head about the connection. It's like somebody could feel like, am I being used? Yes, you are. You are being used, okay? Yeah, Nine of Pentacles energy. And it could definitely be for finances, okay? I feel like this is somebody who be roaming the streets. It's like somebody is together, but they're not together. But the only thing that's holding this connection together is finances and it's really giving that like somebody be penny pinching like they really have a spending problem or they live out of their means okay i am seeing somebody like detached from a water sign energy nine of cups and i feel like yeah four swords when i get nine of cups of four swords energy it's kind of like somebody knew that they were the the wish fulfillment okay somebody's definitely protecting their energy and i feel like with the seven of wands it's like um Something is definitely blowing up in somebody's face, I feel like. Ten of Wands. Like, yeah, somebody's going through some type of karma or hard, a hard time, a hard decision. Okay, so we got the Queen of Pentacles energy, Wheel of Fortune, and Knight of Pentacles. So this definitely could be an earth sign woman. Give me more in this situation. I feel like something slowed down for her. I feel like she could have tried to cause a tower moment or somebody caused a tower moment. Ace of Cups, Ten of Swords, the Sun card, the Queen of Swords. It's kind of like somebody could have been betrayed by a lover and some type of truth could have came out about a betrayal. And I feel like somebody could have lied about it. But it seemed like this woman has gained some type of clarity about this situation. Or it's like, even with this... I feel like, too, I picked this up on my TikTok. Somebody could have paid, like, a spiritual practitioner to cause, like, a tower moment for somebody. Because it's like somebody wanted to slow somebody down. I'm also getting that somebody wanted to cause, like, some type of blockage, just havoc, and somebody like that. Like, somebody couldn't stand that somebody has already moved on. And it's kind of like somebody was doing, like, I heard death magic. And it's like, I feel like this could be somebody who went to that same partition and like, hey, can you do little spells to make this person be in love with me? It's some weird shit. Somebody definitely has, like, a cancer um, moon. But that's all that I have for y'all, Aries. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share to my YouTube channel. Click the bell button so you'll be notified every time I post content. And I'm off here. Yes, yeah, somebody coming in hot with this Nine of Wands energy. Very impressive. Okay. Um, but yeah, I'm off.